So, you're going to show a rabbit in 4-H. Well, here's what you need to know in this video. First things first. You're going to want a carpet square that off shows the beauty of your rabbit. I have a Japanese blue harlequin, so I use a navy blue carpet square to show off the beautiful fur pattern he has. Next thing you need to know is what to expect to wear yourself. Well, as you can see in this picture, I like to dress my own rabbits up. You're going to need a white button-down long sleeve shirt, black slacks, and closed-toed shoes. However, always check the fair handbook before you go into a show. Now for the fun part. Let's actually see this in action. When you go up to a show ring, the first thing you're going to do is go to a four-point turn. The judge will say to approach the table, you do the four-point turn, you set your carpet square down, and you wait for the judge to say, okay, put your rabbit down. Then you put your rabbit down carefully. If he squirms, just go ahead and do what you need to do. You, you pose your rabbit in the proper position. My rabbit is a Japanese harlequin, so he will go in the commercial body type. It's a basketball, half a basketball, excuse me, with a head and a tail. He doesn't like to pose very often, so if that's the case, if he's tired, if he's hot, if he's cold, just let him be. There's also the cylindrical, the full arch, the semi-arch, uh, sorry, the compact, and the, what is it called? Oh, in the commercial body type. I'm checking the right, left eye, sorry, for walleye moon eye, which is a filming or clouding over the eye and can cause blindness. I'm also checking the color for any, which should be a blue gray, because he's a Japanese harlequin. I'm checking for any leakage or excessive drainage. Um, any foreign objects or anything that could cause blindness. Now I'm going to check his left ear for any ear mites. The identification tattoo, which all rabbits should have. His is C94, but you cannot see it from the distance because the camera sucks. Um, okay, so now I'm going to turn him clockwise facing the judge so that I can show him the face. Uh, Dizzy should have, which is the rabbit's name, sorry, should have a straight line going from the nose to the ears and then his ears should alternate, but they don't do that very well. Um, in quality, they should, but they shouldn't. They don't necessarily need to in showmanship, excuse me. Um, they do need to have a V shape, though, um, meaning you could just kind of see the sun peek through. If they're too close or too far, you can get in trouble for that. Um, so now I'm going to turn my rabbit confidently so my rabbit doesn't freak out, and I'm going to show the legs. I'm going to make sure he has a straight legs and they're not sprayed or broken. Sorry, spayed or broken. I don't know how to say that. Then I'm going to take my thumb and I'm going to press it into the pads and the, the toes should show themselves. You just count them so the judge can see. Um, they should be bone colored. Any other color than the Japanese color of Harlequin is disqualification um, or a fault. Um, now I'm going to check the sex. He is a senior buck. I know it's kind of gross, but you do check the testicles as well to make sure that they are intact and neither one is missing. Okay, so I don't know if you guys saw it real quick, but I was counting the spots he had or the checkerboards he had on the other side on his tummy. Um, so now really quick, you turn your rabbit back over and you face him towards the right and then you can quickly check the ears and the eyes again. Um, if he's registered with Arba, then he will have a registration tattoo in his ear, on his right ear, sorry, and it'll just be an R. Now you're checking the fur and I like to face him his butt towards the judge and I check his fur for density, texture, color, whatever. Um, you blow on it to check the fur pattern uh, or fur density. Exactly, I don't know what that is. Uh, and then you explain it to the judge. Um, I went really fast there. I can guarantee you most rabbits aren't going to like to be tipped over. Dizzy has been practiced with especially, so you need to practice. Uh, this is, you show the teeth, you're checking for buck teeth and wolf teeth, which are the same thing technically. Then you check for the legs. Um, rabbits should have straight legs. Um, with rab Harlequins, they need to be opposing. Uh, they have five claws, or four claws, and one dew claw. Um, I check for the jowls, the neck, the dewlap, and the abdomen for abscesses, which are hard lumps. Um, I check them when they're laying down on their back and when they're laying on their stomach. Then you turn them once more to the left after you've completed a full circle on the clockwise and you've done showing your rabbit. Thank you for watching CNC 3 Fulls YouTube Rabbit Showmanship for 4-H. I hope you guys have learned to love rabbits just as much as I have. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to comment, rate, or subscribe.